my fruity friends. How are you this morning, the Monday morning? It's raining here in Finland now, no snow anymore, which is sad because it's almost Christmas, so the Santa can't come when it's no snow. Well, maybe we'll get over it. No presents for this Christmas. Anyway, I got a new haircut today. It's short, I like it, it's easy, uh, makes me look like a puppy, really cute, don't you think? I wanted to make a video today to talk to you about something that I get a lot of, not a lot of questions and it's uh, how to make your boyfriend go vegan because I can uh, I know what it feels like when you first go vegan and your eyes are opened for all the animal cruelty and everything and you want to be healthy and you want to thrive and you want to you wanna teach people about this, you want people to know and then your boyfriend is like, I love my steak, I love my bacon, I love my eggs, you know, and it's, it can be quite challenging for for you to be in that position but I've been a vegan now for two and a half, ye half years and during this time my boyfriend has um, bec has become more and more like a vegan but he's not still completely vegan um, at home we always eat like plant-based foods, no animal products in our house. But when we are out or visiting some like family or whatever, then he might have something. But it's very rare. And um, um, I have to say that it has been but um, it hasn't been like overnight thing for him. It has been like a long time transition into this vegan lifestyle and mostly because I am a vegan is the reason why he has become more and more vegan. And of course I've taught him these things. I've showed him videos about veganism a couple of good documentaries are Forks Over Knives which we watched together and Earthlings is another one another really good one to watch together and of course I have uh, cooked him a lot of like vegan foods made him smoothies um, but he has done a lot of work by himself as well, like he's now buying more and more vegan foods for himself when, he, when I'm not around, cooking vegan foods for himself when I'm not around, and yeah, so I'm really happy about that, that he has uh, found that awareness of himself and the willing to for himself to be more healthy and vegan so you can't force these things on anyone I, I believe that you have to lead an example have to um, of course you can tell people facts about food like where does that come from where does where does that piece of meat come from or that milk or whatever and what does it do to your body of course you can tell people those things most people don't want to listen most people don't want to hear it but some people do and <clears throat> and those are the ones you can help um, my boyfriend is really like open to new things and willing to try new things and really excited about good food and delicious foods because I'm uh, in my own, own opinion, I'm a pretty good chef, like, I, I make good vegan food, like, for example, this weekend I made this 
amazing sweet potato casserole with some help hemp milk and like nutmeg and cinnamon and ginger and it was amazing really really nice food so once you learn how to make good vegan foods that's pretty much it you don't really need anything else of course you have to know the facts about where that food comes from like where the meat comes from you have to it takes time for example for myself when i see a piece of meat or milk i don't think of those things as food anymore they are like they present re represent to me this like suffering and torture and death and murder and all these negative things that i don't want to put in my body anymore and also they make me sick i i don't i i think it's gross to eat those things now i wouldn't eat those things anymore i know too much <laughs> let's say that i i know too much and i want to feel my best that's why i want to eat vegan foods high carb low fat vegan foods predominantly fruits because it makes me feel my best and then high carb foods like rice potatoes pasta sweet potatoes vegetables and they are amazing they make me feel good i i don't feel like i'm missing out on anything once i make myself this really nice um whatever vegan food it can be so much more better i think it's even better than eating um, like meat or cheese because your taste buds gets cleaned out with this diet and you taste all the all the flavors from the food much more stronger and it's so much more fulfilling and makes you feel so much better so that's what I wanted to tell you this morning with my new hair. So be patient, show them all the documentaries, tell them all the truths about food, watch videos together from YouTube, my videos, Freely's videos, Durian Writer's videos, and make lovely vegan food. That's the key to being vegan educate yourself and be aware be conscious of what you're eating thank you for watching and i will see you in my next video if you like this video press like subscribe share share with your family and friends and i will see you soon ciao